Hi, if you like the video, please remember to subscribe. Hi, it's Rob from desireuser.blogspot.com with a quick look at the Evernote Android application on the uh, Google Android HTC Desire smartphone. So, what is Evernote? Um, Evernote is a free app that you can download on the Android Marketplace um, that enables you to take um, photographs, um, text notes, um, audio files and upload them to the cloud or the internet on Evernote servers for free so that you can then access them from your phone or from any other PC or mobile device with a internet connection. Um, but what you can also add are things like titles and tags and descriptions to these notes. So the idea is it's just like having a notepad with you but the notepad isn't on your phone or on your computer, it's on the internet so you can access it from anywhere. Um, to give you a better idea, if I do, if I just tap the search button, you can see some of the notes I've done over the last um, couple of weeks that I've had this uh, app on my phone. So let's have a look what we've got. Here we go, here's a classic example, cushions. So the title of this photo is called Cushions and the tags are Suzanne and Gift. And let's just tap on it. And the reason why I took this one is because I was out and about with my wife Suzanne, and she said, "Oh, I really like those cushions. I wouldn't mind those for my birthday." And so I quickly whipped out my phone, fired up Evernote, and took a photograph of them. So, you know, when it comes around to Christmas or birthday, or if I just want to buy my um, wife a present, I can just type in Suzanne and gift, and that note will come up. Um, here's another one. I was wandering around a shop and they were selling these triptychs which is like a group of photographs um, um, sort of arranged together um, separate images in separate frames and I thought that's a really cool idea I wouldn't mind having a go at that so what I did was I took a photograph of it and then uploaded it with Evernote and tagged it with ideas so it's ideas of things to do and um, what else have we got things like um, oh uh, Suzanne's toolkit box, yeah. Um, Suzanne um, is doing a new course on um, uh, upholstery and she's mentioned a few things she needs to complete her um, uh, toolkit uh, uh, for the course and so she's, she's told me those things. Now normally something like that I'd just save as a text file on the phone or on my computer but by saving it on Evernote and tagging it with Suzanne's tools, tool bags, etc. I can then access it from my phone or my computer, etc. Um, so it's really a powerful little little app, um, and especially because you can't use Google Docs proper, properly yet on Android. Um, this is a, a really cool way of doing it. So this is the main screen. So as you can see, we could take a snapshot. So you, what that means is you can just take a photograph of something. Um, here we go. I don't know. There we go, so I've taken a picture of my um, monitor and then what I could do is I then put a title on it um, monitor say I was in a shop and I wanted to buy it um, so no content, now remember if you've enabled voice um, recognition on your phone you could also use that monitor I want to buy Oh, I don't want to fight it, I want to buy it. Oop. Monitor. Oop. It's hard trying to type when you're looking through a camera screen. Monitor. I want to buy. And then I can add some tags to that as well. So I don't know, GIFs, say. And I can save that, and that will then upload it to the web. So I can take a picture, I can upload a file that's already on my computer. I could do a text note, um, fill it in, and it would save that. Um, or I could do an audio note, so I could record, I tap that, 
Oh, I could record a short memo and then upload it to the web as well. So Evernote, probably one of the most really useful little small apps you can get for your um, Android or it's on iPhone, it's on all the smartphone platforms as well and as I say it's free from the um, Android marketplace so buy it, give it a go um, when you first start you create account an, an account and then so what you can do is on your PC or your laptop or your Mac or whatever you can go to Evernote on the on the web and you can do more advanced editing as well but for on the go this is great especially as I say when you're in shops and you see something that you, maybe you want to buy later or remember for later just take a photograph of it right that's Rob from desireuser.blogspot.com with a quick look at the Evernote app for Google Android uh, HTC Desire smartphone thanks for watching